Hi everyone, welcome back to another Star Stable video. Today, um, I will actually go into Hollywoods out, finally. Why is the lightning so weird? <laughs> Anyways, um, let's open the gifts first. I was hoping for the... Yes. <laughs> That's what I was hoping for, to complete my outfit. Yes, right. Okay, so... Now that we have a full outfit, we are gonna go and check the Hollywood. <laughs> Even though it's weird like checking it at Christmas, I should probably check it like during um like spring or something where there's no snow. Although I could turn snow off, but I don't want to. Um perhaps just for a little bit to like um see how it looks like without snow, but let's just venture into Hollow Woods. Feels so weird. I never ever checked Hollow Woods. It's my first time. Um, I did see all the pictures and all, but it's not the same as if I was to go, so yeah. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's right. Now I can put my. Hmm. Probably do this one. I can do this now. Wow, that looks cool, honestly. Well, let's go check it out. Let me just do this real quick. Whoa. It's so cool, honestly. It looks a lot different, though. It's- I love how they actually kept the vibes, like, I do not feel much different. Although I do see it's much different. Where is the quest again? Alright, okay. Whoa. Sorry if I, like, don't talk much, but I'm just, like, enjoying. <laughs> I mean, I will be turning off snow um, a couple times for, like, some areas like this. I love that. And the water, too. Beautiful. I'll keep the snow for now because it's like winter and I love snow and I want to enjoy it as much as I can. But... Oh, so the orienteering race is here. Okay. I suppose I should check this quest here. Am I right? Oh, so the river goes here too. Okay, I was like a bit confused how this works, but that's fine. <laughs> right. So this is the quest. Let me just see. Um, the mythical hollow woods. Yes. I oh, want this again. Oh yeah, we have to do that too, but. That looks interesting. I should check it out. 150 XP? Really? <laughs> uh, what? Wow, it's as if the rune stone came to life. Also, I have our picture here. <laughs> and there's the rune on our horse. Okay, it's an interesting start. The Rune Runner puts its nose close to your face and puffs out some air. She's saying hello and asking you to follow her. 
Though the horse's mouth doesn't move, it's as if you can hear her thoughts. You have what it takes, come, we must move forward. This is an interesting introduction, honestly. Wow. So beautiful. We're also doing this with the Christmassy horse, which is fun. Here's the horse. And oh, here's the race, I think. I love the sound. <laughs> it's so cute. I need to turn off. I'm sorry if it's annoying for someone uh, with or without the snow, but like... Oh. Um, but like, I want to enjoy the snow, as I said, but I also want to check out the... Maybe I should do it without the snow in a Christmas outfit, but like this. Probably. Let's do that. Let's make an exception for this video. I do also want to check how it looks with snow sometimes as well. But let's keep it like this. <laughs> right. Okay, so... The second race is there somewhere, I believe. Oh, there. Alright. I'm excited to see the village, honestly. Hi! Welcome to Hollywood, unless you have been here before. I love how much XP we're getting. My name is Avina Sunbeam, and this is my small corner of Yorick. And your name is? Where did you come from? That horse just disappeared. I recognize you. Last name. Ah, yes. A long time ago, I helped a young girl settle in this strange village. Took her under my wing, if you will, and so she took my name as she carved a new identity for herself. Oh, really? Seeing as you won't give me your name, I'll have to give you one myself. Now, let me see. Hmm, yes, I have just the one. I will call you Bug, and well, Bug, we have much to discuss. A little horsey told me that the rune stone sprung to life when you interacted with it. How intriguing. You've already seen that there's something about Hollowoods, something magical. Well, the village here is the home of the Keepers of Idine, an ancient network of druids and other folk dedicated to the stewardship of the goddess Idine and her legacy. Tell me more, I know this already. Well, I do know this already, but... Uh, it is true, you have a deep understanding of these woods and the surrounding areas. I could see it as soon as you and Cookie Crumb rode over. But of course, there are things about the world that not even Idin knows, allow me to explain. Not every keeper of Idin is a druid, nor is every druid a keeper of Idin. I prefer to focus on tending to these woods, and that is where I connect to Aideen the most. Others may choose to fight the good fight, seeking to unite the legendary soul riders and keep darkness at bay. No matter what a druid chooses to focus on, one thing is certain, the hollow woods is our magical playground. I think our next topic of discussion requires a little stroll around the premises. Come, walk with me. Are you ready to learn more about the different paths of druidism? <laughs> Yay! I love it. It's so spacious now, even though it's not really the case, like it's actually the same. Oh, is this the um, Farah's workshop thing? Or is it the new... I just love it, it's so cool. Uh, 
Druids are drawn to three main paths of study. There is the path of Terra, the path of Runology, and the path of Whimsy. The path of Terra is everything with the Earth. Gardening... Oh, that's right, we have gardening now. Studying wild plants, brewing solutions, and being one with the land. Gaia will guide you through this path. All right. And this is... Who exactly? Rune stones are ancient structures dotted about the entire island, but in Hollowoods their magic is most intense. It is our duty as druids to study them and dec decipher, I suppose that's how you pronounce it, their ancient secrets. Jade will guide you through this path. Alright. And this is the whimsy path, I suppose. I love this horse actually, so pretty. <laughs> Last, but certainly not least, is the path of whimsy. As the name suggests, this is about embracing fun and letting your curio cre eh. curiosity lead to discoveries. R Rian Rianch will guide you through this path. But we druids are not the only ones who toy with magic here. No, for there are magic horses who are similarly drawn to the buzz of arcane energy in the air. Magic horse sightings have all but dwindled recently, but perhaps if you spend time in the woods they will return again. Okay. And this is the progress thing, probably. I kind of love to wear, do, to wait for her to like look around a bit more. Uh, that was a lot of information, I know, but I have faith in you, Bug. You will soon be one with the in 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 trees in, in of druidism. I don't know. <laughs> We will begin with the path of whimsy. How are we? Approach the big rune stone. We call it the mother stone. Oh, this is like science fiction thing. <laughs> From here, you can determine which path of druidism you want to experience. You can choose to focus on one or all. Now channel your thoughts, surrender to the spirit of Aideen and embrace the path you seek. Here you can access different paths of druidism, okay. Here you can see how much light you currently own. You can use your light to unlock nodes, got it. Click the node to learn more about it. Firefly, un unlock your first node by clicking the unlock button, okay. Firefly catching, talk with Vina to learn more about the secret art of harmlessly collecting the light of Aideen from Hollywood's fireflies. This will unlock fireflies. Unlock. This is level one. Level two, level three, or four. This is so cool. There's like six levels. Oh wow, okay. I cannot click on the others right now, right? Okay. And now the real adventure begins. It's going to be exciting. Fireflies are in abundance in Hollywoods, but they aren't just pretty glowy insects. They are the very essence of the magic of this forest. They are carriers of light. 300? Light is the thread that weaves... Weaves the magic, I think? Oh, Hollywoods together. We druids say it's the residual energy left over from when Aideen brought life to the island in the mythical past. Ride around the woods and gather fireflies. Ten will su suffice. Right, I want to check the village too. It's mostly the same since it actually got updated. Um, they removed the cafe thing. I suppose this is where we do gardening. We miss <laughs> Elizabeth. There's a tree. I don't remember this tree. 
Also, is there the little owl thing? It used to be here. Mm, not sure now. Horace Workshop is still here. It looks pretty much the same. This horse is actually fast. I want to check this area. I suppose it's the same. Mostly, I want... Oh, hold on. I'm gonna collect this. This is water now. Yes. But if I turn on the snow, it's ice. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's actually cool. Oh, my bad. <laughs> the druids are... the soul riders are here. I don't remember them being here. Am I missing something? <laughs> I actually need to progress with the, the quests as well, though. it's gonna be cool. Um, oh, I'm excited. Also guys, I wanna check this course's special animation. And like... Oh, special movement. <laughs> That's cool. And what's its special animation? I totally forgot about this. What the heck? Well, actually guys, this is how I fell off uh, one of the horses. I literally did something like this and like threw me across <laughs> the air and I just fell. It wasn't too bad though. Right, I have to check this area too. Yeah, it's mostly the same, just a bit like tweaked to the graphics and stuff, but it's it's very nice. Right. Oh my. Okay, let's 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 go. <laughs> uh, oh what's this? What did I just collect? Seeds. A collection of wild seeds found in Hollywoods. You can sow them in the communal garden in Wildale to grow plants used in crafting. Seriously? No way. Wow. It's really fun. I like it a lot. Alright, I'm just like gonna do basic quests here, guys. And just so I can actually experience Hollows and then I'll go back to Christmas quests next time. Um, I will also be grinding this on my own free time. That's so cool! Whoa. That's actually so cool. Um, reminds me of some uh, movies and stuff like Harry Potter. But yes, guys, as I was saying, I like just want to cover this basic quest so that I can actually go and do some Christmassy quests over here. Um, and I'll also be filming a video of how much you actually need to grind and how much it actually takes for you to, to finish all of this. Uh, it will take me a long time, though, to, to, to actually do that quest uh, video. You're back already. You must be connected to this forest in ways we cannot even fathom. Your journey is only just beginning. There is plenty more for you to explore out there. A whole forest teeming with life awaiting your interaction. Ride around, be curious, and you will be greatly rewarded. I, rewarded. I will stay here to answer any questions you might have. As your as you progress with the paths of druidism, you will unlock more ways of earning light and interacting with Hollowoods. Very well, you have done great today, Bug. Aiding speed on your adventures, and I'll hope to see you in my neck of the woods soon. Alright, is that it? 
you're getting there is a Christmas quest, Jasper's Tiny Troublemakers is the one I have to do, and the this is for the Yati quest, and this is the Okay, okay. So you want to know more about Hollywoods, what is it you wish to ask? So, you, okay, uh, how do I progress? What is light? Rem um, remind me of the different druid paths. That that was all. okay. How do I progress? There are three paths of druidism you can advance in. Each path has unique activities that will contribute towards your progress. Check your progression in each path by consulting with the mother stone. To learn more, speak with the druid ambassadors of each path. Rayanch, Gaia, and Jade. Keep that bug. Um, what is light? Light is the thread that weaves the magic of Hollywoods together. Richard says the residual energy left over from the Aideen brought life to the island in the mythical past. From when? There are many ways to collect light and progress on the path of Druidism. Explore the woods, let your curiosity flourish, and you will surely be rewarded. Keep that bug. Okay, and I want to check all of it. Mm. Okay, the path of Terra is everything with the earth, gardening, studying wild plants, brewing solutions, and being one with the land. Runestone, runestones are ancient structures dotted about the entire island, but in Hollywoods their magic is most intense. It is the duty of druids to study them and decipher their ancient secrets, and this is what you'll do in the path of phrenology. Last but certainly not least is the path of whimsy. As the name suggests, this is about embracing fun and letting your curiosity lead to discoveries. Let the light of Eden guide you and you will succeed. Keep it up, bug. All right. I'm going to go to ambassadors. Cannot talk to them, right? There is a shop I want to check. Medical marketplace. Nothing. Alright, so I suppose I do unlock these as I progress. Nothing here too. Alright. That is so pretty. Alright, so I suppose I have to like actually progress. <laughs> Um, to have stuff here unlocked. Right, let's check some other shops, maybe they find something. Yeah. Right, so we definitely do have to <laughs> progress to have anything here. What about this? What is this? Garden power powder. This powder uh, frees all the trapped sa satchels in Hollywoods. Right. Okay. Let's sit, let's check the let's check the progress thing again. Oh, it's a rock. I didn't even see. So we have this one. Mm, okay. This takes fifty. I have eleven. Right, Path of Terra. Why can't I unlock Path of Terra? Oh my goodness. Oh, <gasps> holy smokes, that's a lot. <laughs> Whoa, okay. You guys, there's a lot to, to do here, okay. I'm gonna keep it short. It's not that short, but I'll I'll stop here. Just check everything and snow. It's pretty. That's all I have to say. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video where we will actually do um the the race finally this race, and we will probably do. Um, the progress thing that I made um, with Fumble. And then next time we will actually do um, the Yeti quest in Moorland. So I hope you enjoyed. 
and have fun in Hollywoods. Um, I will be making a video on how much time and grinding you actually need to do to finish all of this. Um, so yeah, um, thank you so much for watching again and see you next time. Don't forget to check all the links in the description. Bye bye!